What's up, everyone? Hi Tonight, again. I am with Shirley. We introduced you guys to, to our animals, and um, we just made that a, its own video. So last week you seen, last week you seen our animals. We introduced you to them, and this week we're gonna do some Never Have I Ever. But first, I'm gonna find the shout outs. We forgot to do shout outs when we went to the beach two weeks ago. We forgot to do shout outs when we did the video of the animals. So we're just gonna shout out whoever comes so to mind. So we're just gonna sh do some shout outs I'm gonna on shout the last out to, video. To my, I'm gonna shout out to my four kids, my four grandkids, and go my ahead. eight great grandkids. Oh wow, go ahead. But I got two bonus great grandkids in there. And um, this lady, friend of mine, she's Marie on Marie's thing too. But anyhow, she's my new Facebook friend. Her name is Thelma. I can't pronounce her last name. She just had gastric bypass surgery. That is what I wish I could have. Oh, Marie wow. said she knew somebody to tell them. My friend Lisa had it, yes. And she lost a lot, a lot of weight. Hundreds of pounds. I don't know if there's an age limit or not. Or does it depend on your health? I think it might depend on your health. And I want to shout out to Megan. Um... She works in a mental health care facility, and one of her clients passed away on her watch. Aw, that's sad. Yeah. She says she's used to it, but it's still hard. Yeah, I'm sure it is hard. He was terminal for a while. I don't think it had anything to do with COVID. I think it was more COPD. But if COVID um, had been involved, that would have just sped it up even more. Wow. Yes. That's sad though. It is sad. Well, anyhow, thank you, whoever. I don't know your names right off the bat because I can't. I don't know for some reason I have a headache today. But um, oh, all no. the people that um, it's stress. Yeah. All the people that has um, from Marie's live stream and Marie's fun pages has requested uh, friendship on my Facebook because that's where I live half the time. Facebook. <laughs> I appreciate Facebook, it. Guys. I appreciate it. And please uh, let me know that you are from Marie's pages because sometimes I get a lot of requests and if I don't know who they are or recognize them from Marie's page or whatever, I'll yeah. decline them. Yes. Because I don't just accept anybody. Right. It's not why. I accepted one of my cousins in Alabama it, and somebody hacked his page, made me and Patty. Is that blinking? Yep. Is it supposed to be? It's all right. Just okay. Finish. Made me and Patty think that um, it was him, and it wasn't. Marie wasn't his friend, so they, they, the hacker didn't try to attack her. Unless it was on my old my my personal page that I never go into. Well, then it could, yeah, have been, it yeah. could be. Yeah. I don't know. Who cares? Yeah. But I gotta change the battery, guys. I might we might not even got any of this, so I gotta change the battery. <laughs> Hi again. We're swigging. We took a break so we could have our we have our ice dessert. cream ice cream ice we didn't cream, want to eat ice cream we didn't want to eat before maybe make you jealous for ice cream all right guys so we are going to do some never ever never have I ever questions if you guys want to get your questions in go to Marie's Life Vlogs fan fun page and one question per comment make 20 comments if you want but put one question per comment it makes it easier to go in and copy and paste. Um, oh yeah, I didn't think about that. Hey, is this fan making noises? Turn it off. It probably is. That's okay, turn it off. Oh, how do you do that? Just turn it. Turn it. Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. All right, so we are going to do, here's our boards. We are going to do some. And we're going to, she's going to make another board. Because <laughs> we just came up with this. What was we going to put on it? Um. Not yet. Not yet. Like instead of have not, you know, if it's I something have, we might do in our in, in the future, have not, we're gonna say not yet. Not we're gonna say not yet. Not yet. Okay. I forgot so. what what it was, but um, yeah. Oh, I know what it was. Never mind. Okay. Okay. So she right, always I'm got the questions. She's got them written down from you. Are they questions from the fans? Most of them. Okay. So here we go, guys. <laughs> Oh, shit. Funny. <laughs> this is funny as heck. Okay. And I don't think so because of the age difference between me and her. This would be a good question for her and Patty. But, since she don't play, <laughs> well, I'm going to read it anyway. Okay. Have you 
you or me yeah. ever had a crush on the same person? Ah, oh, I see what you're saying. No, no, I have not. Not even, yeah. No, okay. not okay. even with anybody in okay. my family. All right. Never had a crush on the same person. Okay. Have you ever pranked someone? Yes. Now, my daughter Sheila used to prank me, her, her and my poodle, Cookie, <laughs> used to prank me every, ever, I think I told you all this. Yeah. Used to prank me every uh, April Fool's Day. <laughs> my cat don't look. And, and Sheila would say, come in. And dog would start barking. And I'd say, who is it? And they wouldn't answer me because they want, she wanted me to come in there mm -hmm. so she could say April Fool's. Now yeah. I've pranked several people, but you guys remember, and I'm going to try to find the video. I tried to pull a prank on Omar Gosh TV um, at Spring Hill Cemetery. I got a stuffed, um, what, do you, what, do you, what, do they, what do you call that when they stuff an, an, uh, an animal? Taxiderm. Taxidermy. Taxiderm animal and I tried to prank Omar Gosh TV at Spring Hill Oh yeah, Cemetery. I remember that. Was so it I have. Do you remember? Yeah. Yes. So okay. but I spray, I've, I've pranked other people too but that one just came to my mind. As soon as she read that, that one came to my well, mind. Well then I don't guess I've ever tried to prank anybody unless I, I have to think. I just, so I, that's why I told you about Sheila. Okay. Uh -huh. Well, I think we've already asked, asked this question. I don't know if you know. Okay, have you ever rode a mo motorcycle? I've rode on one, but I haven't never driven one. And I've done both. Okay. I have. Okay. Have you ever pulled a fire alarm, fire alarm for a prank? Never. That's bad. I have not. No, me neither. Um. Went to a drive-in movie, of oh, course. Oh, I have. I think everybody. There's a drive-in theater here in um. Oh, where's it at? It's up by Dade City somewhere. It's a drive-in theater. I stopped and showed you guys in a video. I. It's been a while, but yeah, that's pretty cool. I like drive-in. When I was little, me and Joe was little. Daddy used to take. Daddy used to take me and Joe and Mama to the drive-in theater, and during intermission, they had a playground. To put right underneath the screen. Yeah. Yep. Did y'all go too? Yep. Okay. Yep. Right. I don't think we went with mom and daddy, but I remember going and my kids would go up. I don't know though. Maybe I did play under there. I don't remember. I know I've been to the drive-in though. Okay. Oh. Have you ever smoked candy cigarettes? Yes. Yeah. I love candy cigarettes. <laughs> they still make them. <laughs> and you could blow on them at first and they, like, they, they, just, the uh, candy stuff blows out of the thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, I don't know this, this game, but... Have you ever played Red Rover? I don't know what it is. So Red I Rover, not. Red Rover, send somebody right over. Explain Red Rover to us, guys. I don't know what it is. It's a game that kids played back in the day. Oh, nope, I never have. Must have been never before have. my day. <laughs> it wasn't before your day, it was during my day. But oh, was I, it? I still don't, oh, I still haven't played it. I don't know. It. It, yeah, they will explain to us what it is. Um, of course. Drank from a garden hose. Yes. Yes. All the time. Mm hmm All the time. I'm still alive. Yep, me too. Got health issues, but I'm still alive. <laughs> okay. Oh. Ate bread and sugar sandwiches. Now, if the bread was toasted, I remember Cinnamon butter. sugar. Yeah. But not just plain old white bread yeah. and, and fold it over with sugar no, on it. No. No, me neither. But cinnamon sugar toast, yes. Said the pledge in school, of yes, course. I have. Do they still do that? I think so, yes. I guess some schools do and some schools don't. I don't know. I'm pretty sure. Do y'all have kids in school and do they still do the pledge? I'll have to ask little Tyler. Okay. Um, uh, American Bandstand. Was that going on when you were little? Yes, I yeah. love American Bandstand. Uh, yeah, Dick Clark. He sure, he sure, it took him a long time to age, didn't it? Yeah. He was still looking young when he died. Because mm -hmm. people get, you know, they got so much money, they can afford them facelifts and stuff, surely. I know. They get facelifts and you don't even know it. I want a facelift, guys. I want my eyes pulled back. I want my, this little piece hanging down here picked up. Love. <laughs> <laughs> You're get losing your there. glasses. I know. Mm -hmm. um, had a blood sister or brother. Yes. I'm sure I did. 
I don't remember it personally. What? I had a blood sister or brother. Oh, you do so. Who? I'm your blood sister. And no, no, I think what they're talking about is you <laughs> cut your finger and they cut their fingers, Shirley. What the hell? Well, no, I haven't. I have not done that I don't that know. Way. Is that what you guys are talking about? Had a blood sister or brother. I think it's where you... I don't know if I have or not. So I, I, I'm going to say I have not, but I may have. But if we're talking about blood related, yes. Yes, but I think they're talking about like... You know how your best friend, you, you okay. drug your blood together. Well, I misunderstood that question. Don't do that. Anybody, don't do that. <laughs> I'll use the paint by number kit. Yes, I that have. Was, that was back in the day. It was fun. I, I mean, that's still make before them. social media when you didn't have nothing else to do. I know. That I can think of a lot of stuff I used to play with back before the social media. Yes. I, I could entertain myself real good back in the day. Oh, you know what? I didn't do the, thir the 30 shout outs. I'll do that at the end. <laughs> Did you even find them? Uh, yes. Rode in the back of a pickup truck. I yeah. have. Daddy had a. You weren't born yet. Oh well, I still rode in the back. Daddy wasn't truck. born yet, but Daddy had a truck. It was called Joe's Glass Company. Ah. And um, on the side of the truck, it said Joe's Glass Company. He put in glass in windows and places, but when the glass wasn't on there. Me and Joe and uh, our cousin Alice, and she lives in North Carolina now, but she lived in St. Pete back then. We would climb on that truck like a jungle gym. <laughs> but he wouldn't let us climb on there if there was glass on it. Good daddy. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, collected S and H green stamps. I did. So did I. Look, you get some yeah, good stuff. Yeah, I got some good stuff from S and H green stamps. What was the other one? Some what of you youngins other? ain't even gonna know what an S and H green stamp is. <laughs> the grocery store used to hand them out oh, when you bought yeah. groceries. And you fill up these little books, and then you can buy stuff with your books. <laughs> well, so what was the yellow stamps called? I don't know. There was some yellow ones too at another store. I don't remember them. Okay. I only remember the green stamps. So I have. Okay, drank Kang. Yes. Oh, that was Vince's, my ex-husband. Everybody's drink Tang, have my, I don't know. My my ex-husband, the kid's daddy, loved Tang. It's that orange, it comes in an orange powder, and um, you mix it with water, and it tastes like orange juice. He loves his Tang. Yeah, I think I, everybody, I don't okay. know. Played Tetherball. I like Tetherball. It's a long pole, and there's a rope, and a ball on it, and you sock it. And then the other person would sock it. But you oh, can play it by yourself. I don't remember if I played that Called or not. Called Tetherball. I don't know. That was funny. I think I have not. But maybe. Okay. Oh, shopped at a five and dime store. Oh, yes. All the time. We used to love those. I worked at one. I worked at Woolworth. You worked at Woolworth? Mm hmm I oh. worked in the uh, restaurant section. Oh, okay. I love the restaurant section. That's when Woolworth. I found out I was pregnant with Sherry. <laughs> oh. I... Threw up all over my boss's shoes. Oh, yeah, you did say that. <laughs> Told him that. that. <laughs> and then she decided to take me to the doctor. Okay, I uh, made Jiffy Pop popcorn. Yes, I have. Just see, but I won't eat popcorn no more because when Haley was a baby and I was home alone with just me and Haley and we were sitting in bed and we were eating popcorn and I started choking and all I could think of was Haley's going to freak out and I'm going to choke to death and die. It was stuck in my throat. I it could not get out. I had to beat my back up against the wall oh, wow. to try to get the popcorn. I have never ate it since. Not popcorn with kernels. I'll eat that puffed corn, but not popcorn. I'll never eat it again because I choked bad. Red Highlight Magazine. Yes. That's I like, like a little Christian it. magazine. Yeah. Uh, yeah, when you go to the doctor's office, they still yes. got them. Mm -hmm. Yes, I have read them. Those are cute. I liked them. Mm -hmm. I used to get them for the, ki for the kids when I had custody of Haley, Marcus, and Tyler. Worn homemade clothes or hand-me-downs. Hand-me-downs all the time. I love somebody's hand-me-downs. <laughs> I love going to the thrift store and buying somebody's oh, hand-me-downs. Oh, goodness. I think this... What I got on right now is a thrift store. Shirt. I used to hate going to thrift stores and shopping through junk. Not because it was anybody else's. Just shopping through the junk. I would rather somebody just give me a bag and say, here, go through it and see what you want. <laughs> but now I love going to the Goodwill or the Salvation Army or even like Bell's Outlet. Bell's Outlet's kind of like an exp more expensive Goodwill. But, you know, you have, to, you have to sort through things. It's not like that they have 12 shirts that are the same. You have to sort through. Sometimes you can't. 
they got one of one of a kinds. Tell us some of the thrift stores or secondhand stores or whatever you want to call them. I think Mama call them secondhand stores, but anyhow, yeah. Tell us some of the ones y'all have up there. You, we have a bunch that you've been to, right? Yeah. What are they called? Uh, I've been to, of course, been to Salvation Army. Yeah, I've been there. Been to Goodwill. Me too. Been to Jericho. I haven't been there. I wanted to take you. It's oh, okay. down by the uh, Golden Corral. Okay. It's cheap too. Okay, I'd like mm -hmm. to go there. Okay. Next time we go out to eat, we'll have to go to Golden Corral okay. again. We haven't been since January. And okay. then go um, to the thrift store. Sounds good. And then there's one down by um, by Bell's Outlet. There's a Sheriff's Ranch. A it's Sheriff's a thrift store. Ranch. Yeah. Oh, like on 19? Yeah. Oh, I never been there either. That's a Sheriff's a Ranch. Too. Yeah, that's a good one. Okay. That's where Billy. That's Billy's second home. Oh my God. <laughs> he loves those thrift stores. Oh Lord. I can't think. Oh, then there's Hot. This. They have a thrift store. Really? If we, ever, if we ever go to Ollie's over I in... I know where Ollie's is on 19. If, yeah. If we ever... In Hudson or whatever yeah. it's called. There's a... Um, a hospice thrift store right next door. Oh, wow. And then on the other side, it's a... a not a U-Save. What's the name of that grocery store? Save a lot? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's a nice little plaza. We have to save a lot here, though. You know that, right? I know. Okay. But I said I was just telling you all oh, in the okay. plaza. I think in that same plaza is where I used to get the animal, my animals. Yes, you did, but they closed now. Oh, the diva place or mm -hmm. something. Yes. Yes. I know that them damn flea pills are expensive at the vet, guys, and you have to bring your animal in at least once a year for them to even give you the flea pills. When so. me and Sherry went to pick up some ashes, yeah, we, we circled through that plaza. Uh -huh. To see, because I was going to donate some stuff to in hospice. Yeah. And um, yeah. And then I noticed that oh, you Steve Place wasn't there no more. Oh, okay. If I went out of business through COVID, probably lost all of his business right there. It's crazy. Eight vegetables from the garden, vine right off the tree, or right off the tree. I don't think I have, Shirley. Well, in Alabama, along the fence or somewhere, there was these blackberries or blueberries or something that grew and uh, you pick those off and eat them. But I picked some of my cherry tomatoes recently, not recently, Do you want some cherry tomatoes? Um, I got some in there for you. Okay, maybe. Um, I picked some of them but I don't remember if I ate them. I don't think I did eat them right off the tree. I may have but I, I don't remember. Made fortune, um, for, what? Made paper fortune Oh, those little oh, things. Oh, those you... little things that you go back and forth with. Yeah. Ah, oh, I did. I made them. And then I think we already read this one. Clip cards on your bike spokes to make it sound like you're... Mm -hmm. I did, but how did we do that? I don't remember. I don't know how we clipped them, but I do remember putting something on there so that it would make the noise. Now I would be like, oh, God, I don't want that noise. <laughs> Huh. Did I read that already? What is Have it? you ever did something and blamed it on someone else? Have you ever farted and blamed it on no, someone else? No, it ain't got nothing to do with Have I ever did anything? All right. No, I don't think so. Me either. Have we ever did anything and blamed it on someone else? I'm sure I did when I was a kid, but I can't remember an incident. So I'm going to say... I haven't. I, I don't know. Have not. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Maybe, maybe. we need a we need a not maybe. yet and a maybe. Okay. Um. Not yet. So and we maybe. need a not yet and a maybe card. All right. Because okay. I don't make a note of that. I don't know. Um. Had a nightmare and woke up screaming. Oh hell yes. Me too. Yes. There. I hate that shit. I always have nightmares and and wake up. What when I do have nightmares, I always wake up freaking out. I might not be screaming, but I, when I wake up, I'm crying, and I'm like trying to wake Tyler up. What's going on? This has yes. happened. It's bad. It's bad. You know. Being in a hurricane or a tornado or an earthquake or a natural disaster. Yes. Hurricane for we us. Have. Hurricane Irma. I was in a hurricane when I was pregnant with Angie at in 1985. I was yep. in a hurricane. Being in a car wreck. Yes, I have. I've crashed cars, ran in ditches and stuff, but it's never been like a total. 
But hers was bad. Wasn't mine, it? I, no, mine wasn't that bad. I was in a car wreck um, when I was 16. It was my little orange Toyota. I was headed to my my very first job was at Skycrest Car Wash in Clearwater, Florida. I just dropped Danny off at the daycare and left. And um, there was an ambulance, and the ambulance passed, and you know, a family member for the person in the ambulance happened to be following them, but the ambulance had already went around, and when I went to um, go, because my light was green, they went in front of me and I hit them. But I didn't, it wasn't my fault, because it was because they ran a, red, ran a red light. Okay, we already did the one about the riding in an ambulance, and we couldn't think of any time. No. Okay. How about a helicopter? Have you ever been in a helicopter? I have never been in a helicopter. I've never been in an airplane. Have yet. not. I've been in an airplane, but I've never been in a helicopter. This scares me. I mean, you can go to Orlando and do rides for like, it was $15 before COVID hit. Now it's probably 25 um, It seems like COVID, just all COVID did was rise the prices on everything um, and make people buy COVID tests <laughs> and medicine, right? Yeah. Drove a tractor or riding lawnmower? All the time. You the tractor or the it. riding lawnmower? I rode the riding lawnmower. I've uh, never done that. I don't think I've rode a tractor. You want to come mow my grass sometime ride my tractor? You had a tractor? Yeah. Well, no, it's a riding lawnmower. It's Billy riding, does that all the time. It's a riding lawnmower. Both neighbors. Yeah. Rode on a skateboard or a hoo, hoo, huh? Rode on Hoover, a hoverboard. Hoverboard. I've done. Or a skateboard. I've done both. But I have. I can remember an incident on a skateboard when my bro I was a kid. I can remember this. I don't know how old I was. It was in my the house that I grew up in on 124th. And um, I can remember my brother, Joe, getting on our skateboard out front. I remember that. Just like, I don't know how I remember that. I had, to, well, I was probably, I had to have been, what, at least 10? We bought the house in 74. Yeah, 72. So, 72. So I was between 8 and 10 when I when this happened. I can remember him getting on our skateboard. Caught a fish. Yep, I've caught fishes. Have you caught? You've never even fished, have you? I've been deep sea fishing. Oh, have you? Daddy took me and Joe. Oh wow! And Mama and Grandma got fish for somewhere. I don't know. Oh where. wow! That was fun. So what did you, did you go under? You didn't swim underwater. What you just went out deep on the boat? Deep sea fishing, big old boat. Oh wow! They're lucky. Deep She's boat. so lucky that she had. Has good memories of our daddy and um, th that our daddy. He was fun back then. He didn't drink. He took them places and he did stuff with them. I don't remember him ever taking me anywhere and doing anything with me. So I am happy that she had a good daddy. I know that when I had my son Danny, my daddy loved Danny. Uh, my daddy was still drinking though, but he loved Danny so much and. Yesterday, Shirley texted me and said something about, she was seeing how Danny was, but she said, how's daddy doing? And I responded, daddy's in heaven, but Dan, what did I say? Something like yeah. that. Daddy's in heaven, but I Danny's can't remember. Doing okay. Danny's doing okay. Um, so maybe daddy, I mean, we know, I'm not no maybe, daddy is watching over Danny. Daddy, daddy has daddy always been watching over Danny and Danny used to feel things in that house when he lived in that one house beside us out the valley um, and then that is when I'm pretty sure that is when Sherry Lee had a dream that to tell you the mama came to her in a dream and said to tell me to tell Danny to go to the doctor and take care of himself Danny is that's, my son, guys, and that, he's the one that just had he, a stroke. That could have been when he started gaining a little bit of weight. He was. Okay. He was. But we don't know what year that was. I, I can't have remember. Sherry. I know. She might know. And I she might knows. even have the letter, because Sherry wrote me a letter, I think. My daughter, Sherry, used to have dreams. A uh, vivid dream. Hey, baby. Hey, boy. Have vivid dreams of, like, my mother, our, our mother, her, her grandma. grandma would come to her in dreams. Now this is a good one, I'll tell you. Um, that hurricane that she's talking about. That Ir hurricane. Irma? One of those hurricanes. Sherry had a dream. Oh, it wasn't, it wasn't that one. Well, okay, it was a hurricane one okay. time. Sherry had a dream and Chrissy was living with this girl and I don't know what year this was or nothing, but Sherry had a dream and Grandma wouldn't leave her alone. It was in the middle of the night. Grandma kept coming to her. Call, 
call Chrissy and tell her to um, get that, that, what's the thing called? Generator. When, generator I'm away from the window. Too. And Sherry, I mean, it's in the middle of the night, so she, Grandma wasn't let her sleep. So Sherry that. woke up and she called Chrissy and said, do you have a generator near your window? And she said, yeah. She says, well, <laughs> move it right now. <laughs> so I can get some sleep. No, she didn't say it that way. But yeah, Mama, My ma tell her, mama our mama came to Sherry and told her that. And they did have a generator. Right She's the same window. one that came to Sherry and told her about the worried about. The Sherry's end. come to. I mean, Grandma's come to Sherry. Used to come to Sherry a lot. I wonder I why she doesn't anymore. I don't remember. I don't um, know why. Grandma came to my mama. Our mama came to Sherry. It's should I say Grandma because it was Sherry's grandma, but came to Sherry when Angie was pregnant with Haley, and said that she Grandma told her that she was coming back in Haley. <laughs> and she did and too. Haley's, yes. That's why you're so close to Haley. Yeah, and Haley's got that green thumb like Mama did with all the plants and stuff. She's like, you know. She, my, Grandma, mommy, our mother was a cat lover. Like, uh -huh. cat lover and plant lover. She, yeah. And Haley's the same. Yeah. Yes, definitely. And Haley had a calming spirit. So did our mother. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't remember Haley being as talkative as our mother was, but we got that, Jean. Yeah, we definitely got that. <laughs> Haley's not as talkative. She's definitely not. Mm -hmm. That's funny. Mm -hmm. But we do. Anyhow, I was supposed to read this about TJ's sister, Hope, being there when uh, their mother died. But I was supposed to read this a couple weeks ago, but I couldn't find it. Uh, what is it, Bill? I got the color. I'm going to do the flip. Keep You're painting still? Look at me. Billy, okay. uh... Well, Marie showed you in, in an, Marie showed you in another video that uh, Billy has been painting back there. Billy's painting the house. It's like a can color. Let's give it a go. Oh, okay. Where'd you paint it at? On the wall. Oh, you in the kitchen? Yeah. Take the camera with you. He just, just did it. Oh, the tan. Yeah. I didn't even hear it. Okay. No, did, brush. did you already do your bedroom? No, no. I, oh. The paint that I have, so the I bottom's have. green and the top's going to be that tan. Color, yeah. Boy, he's quiet, ain't he? Yeah, he Why is. Going, I'll be open. He is. <laughs> he definitely is. Wow. It is a pretty color. Yeah. Yes. What it's else do we want to talk about, sister? Oh, I don't know. Anything? Whatever. Is there anything? I've done did anything new going on with you, or mm -hmm. uh, we haven't like we didn't get together last week, right? Was it last week we didn't get together? We haven't got together for a while because of her dizzy spells. My spell. dizzy spells have been. Crazy guys. I'll what? put two more lights out there too. Well, real tall ones. Remember? Uh, okay. The night lights on a big pole. Okay. So it looks good out there. Oh. Okay. From Marie? No. 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 Oh. It's them light, outside light you can put on a big solar. Pole. Okay. Yeah, you put on a solar. Every time oh. Marie mentions something to Billy, he goes out and does it. Yeah. <laughs> the garden, I mentioned, I mentioned you should put some flowers in there for your mama and get some mulch. And he did. <laughs> he did. Um, he takes good care of his mom, and I'm glad he's here because I worry about my sister yeah. all the time. He's a mama. I um, you know, I stress. Uh, I was talking to Billy about this in the car, guys. I stress because I looked at him and I said, "How do you not stress?" I stress about everything. I stress because I'm worried about Shirley. I stress because I'm worried about Haley driving to work or just everyday things. I stress about guys, and it. I don't know. I, I don't know what. Why do I stress so much? Shirley told me to get on antidepressants, and I would stop stressing. So um, I don't know. Haley's been telling me I should talk to the doctor about about some kind of anxiety medicine. Yeah, you don't have to get on. Are you depressed? Or I just don't anxious? feel like I'm depressed. Okay, then she probably just needs anxiety pills. But I got something that I wanted to talk to you guys about. I already talked to Shirley about it when I got here. Go ahead. And when I'm writing down something. When COVID first started. I was, you know, scared to death. I was making all them masks. I made sure I had a mask every time I left the house. I told you guys how I poured alcohol into the to the antibacterial wipes. I, I always had, you know, if I went to the market, I had my mask on. I cleaned the car. And I, I joked. I joked about this in the beginning about when COVID's over in a couple of years, I'm going to end up with rubbing alcohol poison. And this was just a joke, but just recently, I am just like, guys, I have been so dizzy. It, I don't want to start crying about it, because I don't start crying. The dizziness scares me so bad. If, if I get dizzy when I'm in the car, I just, I start crying. And, um, 
it, it scares me that or I'll pull over, I'll get out of the car, I'm jumping around like, God, please just stop. Um, but I was trying to think, okay, well, now I eat a granola bar every morning and I take my medicine. Me and Tyler were trying to figure, is it the granola bar? Is there something in the granola bar that's making me dizzy? I wake up and, you know, I don't have time to move around, so I don't know if I'm dizzy yet. But get in the car to go take him and then it's motion or something, I start getting dizzy. Um, so I started looking things up. You know, I looked up, you know, different things like the granola bars to see if you know I eat them all the time I've been eating them for a year there's no way that the granola bars is what it is but I mean possibly but anyways I looked up rubbing alcohol poisonous what made you look that up thinking about I was looking at my hands one night I even took a picture of them how they, they look waterlogged all the time oh and Disney. um I got some a giver it's and been, um sorry that's okay. go ahead but anyways, I just started thinking, well, what if it's the alcohol? Me and Tyler went went to me and Tyler went to lunch Monday and we went to the Chinese restaurant. I always pull out them alcohol wipes. They're really strong. I pull them out and I clean that whole table. And um, then we go get our food. And um, when we left there, I was I was so dizzy. It was crazy. But when we go to the market and I clean the cart, then my hands stay on that wet alcohol thing sometimes if i'm pushing around in there for an hour sometimes if we're in walmart we're in there for an hour and a half two hours you know looking at plants i'm touching it i'm all not touching i am but my hands stay on the alcohol thing so i decided to look up rubbing alcohol poisonous poisoning and let me tell you dizziness blurred vision i will have to show you i will have to like put a link or not a link, I'll just screenshot it or something, and show you all the side effects of rubbing alcohol. It takes 90 hours for it to get out of your system once you've had too much in your system. But if I've had it in my system since 2020, um, what if I got rubbing alcohol poison? I don't know how you would find out if I got rubbing alcohol poison, but I have not touched rubbing alcohol now since this is Thursday and I didn't touch it Tuesday, Wednesday, or today, Thursday. So I got what, Friday, Saturday, that would be five days. That's about 90 hours. So Friday, Saturday. So I'm gonna see how I feel Saturday, Sunday. And um, see if, you know, I, I don't know. I'm trying to self-diagnose myself. Guys, I'm still waiting to see the neurologist. I feel vibration in the back of my head. Um, I don't know if I could have done this to myself with the rubbing alcohol or if it's just something from, you know, when I had the mini stroke, I mean, or I don't know, anxiety, stress. Um, I had a nervous breakdown when I thought Haley was moving away to wherever it was she was and that, to. Been, oh. Not been that long ago. Uh, it was awful. And then when they told me I had a tumor behind my eyes, I thought I was going to die. I made myself right with God that night. I had a, I, I was just crying and freaking out. And, and I ended up in the hospital that night. Um, I stress too much about everything, guys. I just need, I need to, I need something to calm me down and make me not stress about things. Now, a long time ago, I was on a medicine called God, now I can't even think of what it's called. Uh, I was on an antidepressant medicine, and the side effects was no emotions. So if Shirley, if Shirley started Cat crying toe. about something, or she broke her toe, I wouldn't cry with her. And normally, Paxil. I cry with everybody. Paxil it did wasn't, that to me. It wasn't Paxil. I know, it but was, I'm um, telling you, that's what did. No my emotions. Fa my family like, could not stand it. Yeah, I had a, um, my dog out of the surgery, and they were all freaking out and and crying and upset. I could care less. Yeah, no. That's emotions. how that's how I was with that medicine. I can't think of what it's called now. Um, I still actually have some at the house. Um, yeah, I can't think of what it's called. But, but it anyways, was Paxil, it was an huh? antidepressant. It wasn't Paxil. Um, I need something to calm me down. I really do. I think the worst of every situation, you know, when they told me I had a tumor, I'm dead. Okay. That's somebody's behind me. There's Ooh. nobody behind me. Surely something just touched me. John, well, leave Marie alone. No, it, it didn't hurt me, but it's I thought one of the cats were behind me. No. Something just touched my back. It's John. 
It might be Mama. Oh, Mama. Somebody's talking. Or Daddy. You sure there ain't nothing back there? There's nobody. Right. Something just, somebody just touched Maria. That's the so cat. weird. I thought the cat was behind me. It's gone. Oh, my oh, gosh. Gone with her. It could be my mama. We were just talking about mama well, and everybody. Well, turn on the thing and see who it was. my bike all the time. Turn on the thing. Oh, you want to turn on the ghost? Um, yeah. Spirit this talker. For, you guys want to hear the spirit right. talker? This is for, um, like you said, your hands are always in moist. Okay. It, this is. Oh, great. okay. They gave it to John, but it's never been used. Okay. When I'm out of the shed, I hear his voice out there. When I'm out of the shed. You hearing? Yeah. It's okay. for people. There's nobody around me. I hear somebody talking. Who? Somebody just touched me right on my back. Right here, she so. jumped up. And there's nothing behind me. I, I thought it was one of the cats. No. Not here, though, you know. yeah. Well, it could be him. Yeah. It could but, be Mama. Um, what were we talking know. about, Mama? Oh, you know we were why? talking about the rubbing alcohol poison. And maybe it's like giving me a nudge. Yeah, that's what it is. He don't like changes, so never. You know. Oh, okay, Billy's we're going to find out and see who it was. John, if it was you, don't take it out on me because Billy's painting the house. Don't take it out on Billy. Billy had... John hated changes, so Billy's painting the house. He's pushing. Take right. it out on Billy, not me. <laughs> All right, guys, here comes the spirit talker. We're going to listen. And did you guys hear the disembodied voice in the video that I did right here at Shirley's house? It was one of the last few videos. I can't remember which one. Um, I'll try. What did it say? I can't remember. I don't think I understood it, but sometimes the fans go in and tell me what it says. Okay. So yeah. maybe I don't know. I can't. I couldn't hear what it said. All right, guys. Here goes the spirit talker. I turned mine on too. Oh, you? Oh, you got it? Yeah. Oh, yay! Let's so see. we both Let's have it. Let's see. Hey, John, did you just now touch Maria in the back? Did you push her? She blamed it on the cat. He's gonna say, "Nope, it wasn't." It's just me. like a touch. It was so weird because I thought the cat was behind. Y'all saw her jump. I thought the cat was behind me. I thought a different cat was behind me. How come that's no sound? It, oh, is your sound off? No. Did a word come up yet? It no. takes time. It's on. We're trying to communicate with the person that just touched me. Who touched me? In in the in my back. Well, come on, sound. It will. <sighs> Unless your words already popped up, it will. There. There. Oh, your sound. Yours don't have a sound. sound. It's, it's on. There. Did you hear it say? Yeah. It's not very loud. Oh, mine said yes, I will. Mine's not loud either. How come? I don't know. Oh, mine was all the way down. All right, mine's up now. Mine said yes, I will. And mine said there. I asked who touched me. <laughs> it says yes, yes I, I will. will. You gonna touch her again? Yes, I will. Uh, that was so weird. I thought one of the cats was like behind me, like tapping me. Like the one cat got me and then cut my finger open. No, she's, she's sleeping. That was that one? The big gigantic one? No, that's Panther. Okay, it was this one right and there. And that's him. He was sleeping. Oh. Well, something just touched my back. Let me know if you guys saw anything. Yeah. If something touched me. Because she jumped and scared the crap out of them. Probably scared them too. He's dangerous. Who's oh, that? shit. Ooh. He's dangerous. He's dangerous. <laughs> the cat or? <laughs> she's petting. She's petting um, Bear and John told her that uh, he's dangerous. We know John. He scratches all the time. Is yours on? What's yeah. What's saying? Nothing. Mine says group. <laughs> it says group. Group. Yeah. A he's group dangerous. The group of cats. <laughs> Him. Castle. Castle? I don't know anybody named Castle. That's a castle. Like, there's a castle down the road, down the corner from there. Really? It looks like a castle. It's probably a restaurant, but it looks like a castle. Are you talking about your friend, John? Her, he, had, he had a friend that died. Oh, last year, whatever. What was the name? Her her name was Kathy Castle. Nuh-uh. Uh-huh. Oh, wow. It must be John. She's there. I know she is. She's a sweetheart. Kathy Castle. Yeah. Well, it just said castle. I know. Are you talking about Kathy, John? How come your thing talking? It will whenever something comes across it. Your cat's got its paw over top of it. John, we're wanting to know who touched Marie. We're not talking about who's in heaven with you. That's the Kathy Castle. Photo. Who? Take photo, Shirley. Take a <laughs> photo. Okay. 
of you? I guess. All right. I don't know. How can I? I don't I know. I like the toys. He likes the toys. The ghost toys. You like I, the ghost toys? I took a picture that way. I'm taking a photo this way. Is that my head? Okay, that shadows my picture, head. Take a picture of the take a picture of the dangerous cat. I was just trying to figure out what take a photo of what? What do we want us to take a photo of, John? I like the toys, huh? Hey John, do you like Maybe we're tired. gonna see orbs. He's tired. Aw. Well, we know you're tired. Hey, do you like what Billy's doing with the um Walls, walls back there. Billy's paint job. Okay. I told us to take a photo, guys. We're taking a photo. What are you taking a photo of? Of like back here. Oh. To see if the, you know, there's so weird. Like who was it? I see my shadow on the wall. That's my head on the wall mm -hmm. back there. That's weird. I'm anxious to know what they felt. I know. Take photo we did we took the photo what was we supposed to see <laughs> there's something we were supposed to see in the photo mine says there he's dangerous talking about him because you were petting him yeah. when you said that castle i like the toys and tired tired what toys what toys do you like i know we didn't like any he didn't no. like what who fell did you fall, Shirley? No. Did you fall, Marie? So um, I fell. Did any of y'all fall? I'm trying to think. I didn't fall lately. I have fell, but not lately. I fell too before. I hope I ain't gonna fall anytime soon. I hope not either. I, I watch where I walk and I look down instead of just assuming them. <laughs> Cause there's always something in the floor. Oh, mine said free. So his free, his soul's free. Yeah, his soul is free. Well, we still ain't figured out who touched Marie. It's not going to tell us. No, it's not. That's crazy. I, I weird do because... Whisper, in, if the spirit's in this house and you know who touched me, whisper in the camera. Give us another disembodied yeah. voice. Yeah. Um, I'll have to go back and see if you guys commented on... Anybody commented on the disembodied I voice. found it on here. You, you found it? it? You know which video it was? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to turn this off and you talk to them and I'm going to go okay. find it for you. Shirley's going to... What? What does it say? <laughs> He's angry. I asked him angry. how do you like what Billy was doing. Oh, shit. <laughs> Maybe you should leave that on. Okay. Why are you angry? <laughs> you don't like what Billy's doing with that. <laughs> oh, he's angry. <laughs> he hated it when Shirley. Billy did anything to him. Mine says true. <laughs> Yours says true? Yes. John's angry that Billy's paint. He didn't want nothing done to this house. He would have left it. Uh, he uh, would have let it fall apart. Oh, yeah. He would have left it as a disaster. It looks so much better since um, Shirley and Billy's been cleaning it up. <laughs> Way better. Inside and outside. Yes. Oh, my gosh, yes. Shirley's going to find the video. I will let you guys know the name, the, the name, the title of the video, and the timestamp. You guys can Yeah, go. somebody, one of your fans told me she went right to the timestamp and oh, found it. Oh, okay. I'll go, I'll go get it. Okay. I'm going to go over here on Marie's, um, yeah. So we will um, continue to listen. Threatening. Threatening? threatening. Is he going to threat, threaten Billy? Uh, somebody gets me to get threatened. Because he's, because he's touching the... R-A-F. What? R-A-F. What does that mean? R-A-F. Rap. The raft of who? Oh, it said, shit. It said R-A-F. What are you mad at Billy for, John? He's improving the dump. Billy's making the house look nice. <laughs> R-A-F, guys. If you guys know what that means, let me know. Raft. Raft of what? Let me know this timestamp and in the comments if you know what that means. Come on, now. R-A-F. All capital letters. Hmm. I don't know. What's That's... your videos under? Marie's live stream? No. Marie's live vlogs. YouTube. Right. 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 The raft. I think he's talking to both of us. I think so too, but I'm trying to find that thing. It's on YouTube. Oh, YouTube. Remove. Remove. What are we removing? 
the stuff that Billy did. Billy remove too much of your stuff. <laughs> oh boy, he got really pissed off when Billy moved all that stuff on the patio. Well, he wasn't alive, but well, he was sort of, kind of, semi-conscious. Oh, so he was still here when Billy moved the stuff off the patio? <laughs> yeah. He, oh. He was. I don't know if he was aware of what was going on though. Yeah. That's sad. All of a sudden I got really sleepy, Shirley. What the heck? Uh-oh. Okay, I'm, I'm still looking for it. Sarah, I, the battery. The battery? Uh-oh, something's happening to the battery again. Sarah, I got my battery charging down. Maria, I got it right on the thing. Look. Okay. That's where I'm at. Oh, stop it. Just step into them and they pop on. Right there, see? That's where you Oh, yeah, it. I have to put headphones in. All right, back up to right before it starts. Oh, I was supposed to see it. And then they'll have to, I'll have to give them the time stamp. Oh, yeah. I'm going to eat you. That's late we already did. Okay. My um, favorite grandpa, um, Joe. It was 112 was something. 112 18, point. Oh, wait, hold on. 1890 something. 1897 or something like that. I'm sure it happened. In and which video? What's the title of that video? Real Talk with Charlie Marie episode. Season one, episode, episode nine. Right. All right, episode nine, guys. Oh, oh, one hour and nine. 12 and minutes and some what I want to do. one hour and 12 what? minutes guys go I listen to that disembodied voice and let me know what it says it. season one episode nine mine just now said I am an angel I'm an angel and mine said um I'm We're very happy in each other so I am an angel I am very happy oh wow yeah. who's threatening so he's happy in uh, no heaven threatening Marie. okay Oh wow! Acknowledge. We're not Acknowledge. Live. He's in heaven and he's happy. Here we go. One twelve point thirty seven. Okay, so go check out that disembodied voice. Let me know what you think it is. Look at the com. Did you look at the comments? Lee might have known what it was. She might have heard it. I haven't looked at the comments oh, today. Okay. So anyway, anyways, what did I say? Satanic. Satanic. What's that mean? Something to do with the devil. <laughs> I don't know. But he said he was happy. Happy, and I'm an angel. If that, if that's him, we may be talking to multiple spirits. That's we could be talking to oh, the spirit that used to live in this house. Attached. Attached. It's gonna be okay. Or lived on this land. Attached. Make it through all this stuff that I'm going Attached. Through. That's a satanic. And she's not talking to John. Sat I'm just talking that's to him. A satanic something's like, attached. What's it attached to, John? Is it attached to this phone? I will not have to say it. We, have, we, we did say it. Just say it your whole We house. forget to pray before we do this. We stuff. do. Harold. Harold. I Who? wonder if a Harold I'm lived here. I'm in the here. shadows. He's in the shadow. Oh, wow. I wonder if a Harold lived here. Wouldn't it be cool? I could do the property appraisers on this house and find out if a Harold ever lived or ever owned this piece of property. Okay. So I will do the property appraisers and I will find out if a Harold ever owned this piece of property. Maybe we're talking to Harold. I mean, I wish that it would come through and say, no, it's not Harold, it's John. <laughs> and then we would know. Or no, it's whoever. And then we would know. We want to know who we're talking to. Can you tell us your name? On either one of our um, spirit talkers, tell us what your name is. That's what we want to know. Sarah and Harold. I'm going to see if they ever own Sarah. this property. Sarah came out earlier on my <laughs> Our aunt? Could be. Is that right in? Taste. 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 What? What are you tasting? Surely. Huh? Bones. Yours said taste and mine said bones. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> taste bones? Ew. <laughs> That's yucky. Francis. Francis? Francis. I don't know Francis. I did, but she died. <laughs> I used to work with her at Sam's Club. Sarah, Harold, and Francis. We'll have to try to look them up. See who I don't is. even have no neighbors named that. No. Mm -mm. How did they spell Sarah? S A R A H. Okay. 
there. He's dangerous. Castle. I like the toys. Tired. Fell. I'm angry. Threatening. Right. The battery. I'm very happy. Titanic. Attached. I'm in the shadows. Taste in Francis. Wow. Mine just said anybody. Mine said C. Yes, I will. Group. Take photo. Free. True. Raf. R-A-F. It didn't say rap. It said R-A-F. Remove. Sarah. I'm an A. Take another photo. All right, guys. So I had to change my battery. I just put a brand new battery in here and it died already. Um, it has said so many new words. It said take photo again. What am I taking? I'm going to stand back here and take a photo. Yeah, take a photo over there and see if you see what touched you. It's just crazy. Where are you at? Show yourself. That would be over there. By the I thing. took a bunch of photos. All right, guys. So I was reading off names. Did it gonna touch your leg next time? I don't know. If you if her leg. <laughs> <laughs> um. So I was trying. I was reading off the words that my my spirit talker was saying, and the, the camera just went off. All right. So it said. Oh. Ghost. We lost some of the words. Now it's a ghost. Uh -huh. Take photo, ghost. Um, now I have to go in and find the, go out and find the words. Where's my folders? I have to stop mine for a minute to go find the words. Well, the last word I have was taste. And then I had Francis, communicate, Henry, no I didn't, 20, and leg. Where are those words that just came through? I don't even see them. Did they get deleted? They shouldn't. They go into a folder. Skeleton. Okay. Skeleton. Skeleton. All right. Well, yours said ghost and mine said skeleton. <laughs> yeah, my, I got to stop this because now I don't have the words at all. I don't know what happened to them. I was reading them off to you guys and they just disappeared. Are you comfortable? Mm -mm. <laughs> he probably is. What well, is he being good? Yeah. 8522. Do I not have the date on here right? 8522. It isn't even 8522. What's going to happen on August the 5th, 19, I mean 2022? I don't know. What? I just turned mine off. I don't know what's going on, guys. I can't find the words. They're gone. Well, y'all heard them. She read them off to you. That's so weird. Maybe I gotta exit completely out and then bring it back open for them to go in the folders. Oh, you got a spirit box? That's the original one I had. Oh, ask that question. Hey, what's going on over here, John? Or whoever you are. What touched Marie on the back? This ain't slow, this spirit box is slow, yeah. I can't find the words anywhere. Well, this is a good time to clip your toenail, boy. Yeah, Usually boy, the boy. words are saved, guys. They're not saved on here. And I don't know why. No clue why. Hmm. Shirley's got the spirit box going. Your box is slow compared to that other one. Do y'all have any of these apps on your phone? Nope, I ain't gonna come back. Let me know what you guys think of the Spirit Talker. The one she had on before, if you can remember any of it. If any of those words she read out made sense, let her know. Yeah, well, I'll be able to hear what I said, you know, in the video. Yeah. Um, until the battery died. Um, spirit is draining my battery. And on Shirley's, it said something about battery. Mm-hmm. 
What's so, that mean? They were What's draining that word? my battery. I got three batteries. What's this now. word mean? What's that word? Scenario. Scenario. What is a scenario? I don't know. What's the scenario? I don't know what the scenario is. What's the scenario? I don't know. That's crazy. I don't know what it was that touched my back, guys. And I don't know what is draining my batteries that quick. To drain three batteries that quick. I have no clue. That means there's a spirit in here. Something is trying to drain the batteries. Need to rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Yes. Well, we saged the house, what, two weeks ago? Yeah, I guess you're going to have to sage it every time they come over. Yeah, we saged two <laughs> weeks ago and we, um, Bust the house and pushed it all out the door. Unless the cats brought it back in. Scenario, and then now this says crescent. Crescent. We um no, pushed all the spirits out, out in that porch where the cats are, and then out that side door. So um, you would think who that brought them back in? Uh, the cats, maybe. I don't know. Maybe they Billy, don't go out there. Maybe though. Billy brought them back in. I don't maybe. want to talk. You don't want to talk. Ooh. They said I don't want to talk. <laughs> don't want to talk about it. All right, shut up then. <laughs> Tell you. They don't want to talk. Do we bore y'all? We <laughs> don't bore them. You ask them that every week. I we know. Do not I ask them, them that every week. They say you could talk. Y'all could just sit there and and we'd look at y'all for two they, hours. They they look. <laughs> People, they look forward to our Monday nights. I know they do. Um, they love us, don't they you? Love we us. appreciate it. Yes, <laughs> we definitely do. Somebody loves us, Shirley. I'm thankful. We don't Somebody have, besides we our don't family. We don't have to be lonely. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody loves lonely. us. I'm not lonely. Sometimes I'm lonely in my house, and I have a house full of people. Sometimes I feel like I'm always sitting Agreed. down to dinner by myself. Yes, Agreed. you do. Every time you cook. I'm always by myself. So I uh, Sarah. Sarah. Oh, now it said Sarah S A R A. Oh, that's our aunt. It said I don't want to talk, and then it said Sarah. Hey, uh, John finally met Sarah up in heaven. Oh yeah. Yeah. She's a fun aunt. Marie, I remember her as much as good as I do. But when I was when I was um little, that was my favorite aunt. I actually have Sarah and Grandma on videotape. Um, I don't know where the videotape is, but it was one of the big old cameras. It says run, Shirley. It says run. <laughs> Exercise. I have this her is on, for, uh, little on Ty. videotape. I started to say Danny. I was thinking of uh, Danny when I walked through the hallway. That's for little Ty here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Haley wasn't feeling good today. She says, I took a COVID test. It's negative. <laughs> Thank God. Yeah, please. <laughs> Dang. Do y'all take COVID tests? Do you get those free ones in the mail? Yeah, you can get it. We're supposed to be able to get two more batches. I can get free ones in the mail through those people, and I can get free ones in the mail through my insurance company. Oh, wow. So Haley could, too, through her insurance company. Yeah, I never figured that out. You never did go on there? Never figured out how oh. to do it. So we got some chewy fudge brownies. Little Tyler will have to make them tomorrow night because tomorrow is his last day of school and um, he's going to be so excited. So he can come home to his box of brownies and he can make his brownies or I can make them for him while he's at school um, tomorrow. What grade is he going to be going into? He'll be going in the 10th. Wow. Yes. My birthday twin to grow up. Yes, he is. <laughs> He definitely is, and he, um, God, he's so much taller than me. He, he, he spends the summer with me every year. And, hey, um, I want to tell you something. He's, when you, um, you get done. he's very helpful. Like this morning, he was out there helping clean out the pool. It wasn't this morning? It was this afternoon. He was helping clean out the pool and um, the vacuum the inside. I have a vacuum that vacuums for me, but he kept missing this one spot. So I hooked uh -huh. up the vacuum that we manually do, and he got those spots for me. 
but he helps me all the time. Little Tyler helps me more than anybody, um, more than anybody in the household. But um, I appreciate him. He stays every summer with me. So I'll have, you guys will probably see him in some videos this well, summer. guys, I hope you enjoy yeah. our Never Have I Ever. Um, and like, you know, we don't have to always play Never Have I Ever. You can send us questions on topics you want us to, you know, if you think it's a topic that I'm going to have one opinion and she's going to have another and we can do like a little heated thing. Yeah, That would fun. be kind of cool too. That'd be fun. Um, we, I, I still want to do like the baby food challenge. Yeah. Um, I actually, dang, I should have thought about it. Maybe what? next week you can come to my house. Okay. Well. I have Haley's friend from Australia sent her all kinds of different Australian okay. candy and chips and all kinds of stuff. Okay, good. We'll be and I, she's like, I don't like this. I was like, put it in this bucket, put it in this bucket. I'm yeah. going to do a video with it. Yeah. So me and Shirley can yeah. do a video I with it. I have never been over to Marie's yet. So that, and we've been planning on me coming over. All she has to do is drive over here and get me yeah. and drive back. I tried to get you to come over for Easter. I didn't feel like it. Yeah, I know. It's okay. Me and Billy wanted to have our That's okay. time I understand. Alone. It's fine. But I mean, just for the uh, Monday thing. It don't even have to be Monday. It could yeah. be any. Whatever. It could be the weekend. Who cares? Yeah, whenever. Yeah. But yes, maybe she can come to my house because we have a box full of Australian stuff that we could do the taste test with. Um, I want to do the baby food challenge. And I'm not getting in the damn pool. And she says she's not getting in the damn pool. I'll right? put my feet in it. Oh, well, there you go. That's cool. all Haley did the other day. I seen her. Did you see that video? got more views than the dang jail. <laughs> I just couldn't believe it. That, that <laughs> they I love, don't know what's going on with the jail They love the personal. Videos. Per personal? Yes. They love the purse. I don't know how the to The vlogs. The personal vlogs. That what was so remember? much fun. On you know, that video y'all saw uh, at the beach. Yes, that, that was, was the first. Fun. We that just start doing fun. some first I want to stuff. bring Henriette with us next time, guys, so Henriette can help me get Shirley out to the water. Yeah, I can't uh, walk off the ball. So we'll get her out to the water and sit her down in a chair, and she won't even have to get out until it's time to leave. <laughs> and um, then we'll be closer to the water. She can feel the water on her feet. Yeah, that would be good for my feet. Salt water? Yeah, yeah. would. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That would be awesome. Um, so any, any more suggestions of videos that we could do that you want guys want us to do we could go see the mermaids one day if you wanted okay i've been there once uh, and i've seen the mermaid show i actually i've only it. been there when i was a child and i definitely want to go down to pinellas and go to serenity Gar not serenity that's where mom and daddy was buried um sunken gardens but I, but first off i think that we should go see our brother yeah because our brother's not doing well we should go to mom and daddy's grave and go see our brother even if that's the only thing we do on that trip mm -hmm. um I don't know. He's not doing well. You know, my son's not doing well. Um, I'm not doing well. You know, we're all up there in age. We all have our own health issues. So keep keep this all in your prayers. Pray for my son especially, guys. I'm just so worried about him. He's my baby. I mean, he's only 15 years younger than me. He's 42 years old. I had him when I was 15 years old. Um, and... Um, He's always going to be my baby boy. He's my baby boy. And you know? Billy's my baby boy. So, um, mm -hmm. when I, when I, when I heard he was in the hospital, it, I knew, I knew he told me what, what he went in for. And I knew he had a stroke. I knew it. It just, I, same you know, side as our mother. They, they said it was deep in, in the, in the center of his brain. Oh, wow. Um, but it was a mild stroke. They said it was a mild stroke and that he didn't have it the day he went in the hospital. He had it that week sometime. Oh, wow. He was in and out of the hospital, the emergency room, that whole week before with different symptoms. And, and you said he, he was weak and could hardly walk. He walked. said that that Sunday that he felt like he was going, he was dying. He was laying in bed. He felt like he was dying. He couldn't even drive himself. He had his wife take him to the hospital and they kept him. That's when they did the MRI and they found something in his brain and I, as soon as I talked to the nurse and they told me that, I'm like, it's a stroke, isn't it? She's like, it's possible, but I can't say for sure it is. We have to do the MRI with contrast. And then that's when they confirmed that it was definitely a stroke that had happened a few days prior. Um, so he's lucky that he, he's alive. You know, Mama had her stroke and... Oh she lingered God. five months. She did. But who knows? She could have had it like Danny. It's so scary, you know, because so mama had the stroke, then I had a, a mini stroke, and now my son had a stroke. That is probably hereditary. It's probably going to go through the system in the family. 
strokes and heart attacks run in our family. Um, keep us all in your prayers. Just please keep us all in your prayers. I don't know what's going on with these dizzy spells. I talked, did I talk to them about the alcohol poisoning? I don't know if you talked to them on this one or whatever, but yeah. I did talk to them. He's going to check it. into the alcohol okay, thing. So, um, it's not, a possibility. not rubbing alcohol, guys. Not alcohol. Not, I don't not drink booze. alcohol. And I don't drink rubbing alcohol, but it, like I said, it was all over my hands. I, I'm constantly using yeah, it. Yeah, you might not have clarified that. So, yeah. yeah. I, I think I said Rubbing that. alcohol to sanitize yeah. stuff with. I'm sleepy. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, let us know if there's anything else you want us to talk about. I mean, we just blabber on every week. And, and let about us know whatever. you've seen whatever hit her in the back. Whatever touched me, because I swear I thought it was a cat. Nope, they were sleeping. Me. I just figured another cat jumped up behind me and touched me. I know, and you just, um, <laughs> just when you jumped, weird. you probably scared the crap out of them, too. Probably. <laughs> it was really weird. It was. And if you've seen something or heard something, Find a timestamp so we can go back to it yes, and see if we definitely. see it or hear it. Definitely. Yeah. It would be cool to see what it, what that was. Because, I mean, what could have touched my back like that? You know, there was no was animal. Spirit. I got a bunch of pillows behind me. There's nothing behind these pillows. A bunch of pillows. They were sleeping. Yeah, I just, I seen him sleeping. I just assumed it was another one of them no. animals up on, my up on my back. Not even Gracie. Was she usually sleeping with you? But it wasn't she is usually sleeping with me. Uh -huh. She's not now because of bear. No. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next week. Bye, Bye. guys.